container diet. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I have another crazy thing for you. I want to talk to you today about the about the container diet. The container diet, yes. Okay, a little bit of a story background. Everyone's probably like, Lori Lee, you just did the Whole30. You do all this stuff all the time. What are you talking about? Well, most of you know if you watch my videos, I was in a car accident. I'm still in physiotherapy and I cannot work out right now because my back, my lower back is where I get a lot of pain from. So and sometimes my neck, even though I'm moving great, um, I just haven't had the all clear to work out, which really stinks because we are two and a half weeks away from Amy Lee's wedding, my twin sister. And I went last week, Saturday, to the mall to get my dress stitched and, you know, fixed or whatever. When I got the dress, I was actually, um, well, I was in, like, in the middle of working out, eating healthy, yada, yada, yada. And when I got in the car accident, that really threw things off. I was eating really bad because, like, the first day that I got home after the car accident happened, I ate McDonald's. And I ate a 10-piece nugget meal. It was just like the comfort food. And that kind of began the spiral of bad eating during the few weeks that I was off work. Um, and to no one's fault but my own, I just, I was going to food for comfort. Anyways, fast forward to last week, going to get my dress hemmed, I realized I could barely do the sucker up. So, and I can't work out right now. I haven't fully done Whole30 round two because again, they talk about doing the Whole30 100%. You really need to plan, you know, a good time when nothing is happening. Well, I have my sister's bachelorette party. We had showers, birthdays, yada, yada, yada. So it really wasn't a good time to be doing it. But for the most part, I eat like the Whole30. I don't eat any um, processed foods, any unnatural sugars, things like that. Or And, and if I do... It's a splurge, no diet products. I eat, try to eat whole and healthy foods. But when you kind of go out of control and yada, 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 go into old habits, I may have gained a few pounds. So I was looking for a really, really quick solution. Um, my sister and I, last weekend after I dropped the dress off, we uh, went to go look for some wedding things and we randomly I just said let's go to bed back to me on I think we were looking for some candles and uh, so we walked in the door and lo and behold this is what I saw the perfect portions portion control containers get fit easy way to lose weight $14.99 and if you know me I'm not uh, like great if I don't have a plan but if I have a plan that I'm sticking to I am so disciplined that's why when the whole 30 ended it's been slightly difficult because I know I'm not doing it a hundred percent so I have two and a half weeks and I thought I gotta get into this dress so I'm doing this so I thought I would just show you really quickly what this is and it's kind of funny everybody everybody is making fun of me for it because it's hilarious but if you are like me and you either can't work out or you just don't like to work out and you don't mind being on a restricted plan, uh, then this is this would be for you. Now, the one thing I will say is this is not unhealthy. Um, okay, yes, you are lowering your calories, but I am eating whole foods. I'm not eating any sugar. I'm eating good foods, nothing that's processed. Um, the whole concept is that you have these get it containers Ooh la la Ooh, okay so you get in the box you get all those containers as well as you get this kind of guide and basically what they I didn't read this but what I read online is they show you how to like basically get to um, your weight loss so you basically do this equation of what you want to weigh times a certain amount 
and then you look at the chart with where you want to weigh and it tells you how many of each container to eat. It also gives you some, uh, so it shows you here your meal plan, it gives you all of the food, the food reference guide, which is really helpful, like what can go in each container, what cannot, free foods that don't mean any, equal anything, and then some recipes. So it's really small. I mean, for $14.99, I, I think it's awesome. So for me, I'll tell you exactly what I'm eating. I get three veggies a day. They're a little, sorry, they're wet. I just, they just came out of the wash. I take them for lunch every day. So this is three veggies a day. So um, I usually do fruit for breakfast and then I'll have one veggie at lunch and then two at dinner. So I'll do like a salad and broccoli. I get four fruits. So I actually have a fruit in the morning, a fruit for a snack, a fruit at lunch, and a fruit after dinner. So that really helps and it's usually grapes. And so it's probably like 15 grapes or 20 grapes that fit in this, but it's enough for me, or an apple, um, which I just slice up, pretty much one apple, you know, you can get in there. Um, I can have two proteins, so I usually just bake a chicken, and then I cut it up, and then portion it out, so I'll have chicken at lunch and chicken at dinner, yes, this sounds really boring, but when you're on a strict plan and I need to get into that dress, in two Sundays from now, uh, I'm okay with eating chicken and broccoli every day. What I actually side note, what I did was I cooked up zoodles, so zucchini noodles and olive oil and garlic and ate that with chicken. It was like it tasted like chicken alfredo. It was so good. Um, I could have one of these carbs a day, so I usually have um, quinoa or like a quinoa blend or something like that. This doesn't say anything, but this is healthy fat, so I can have avocado, hummus, yada, yada, yada. So that's what I usually have. I usually do like a hummus, which is not Whole30 approved, but I do an organic hummus uh, with celery. And that's really good. That's like my afternoon snack between like 2.30 to 4.30 is when I get the munchies. So um, I have one of those. And then seeds and dressing. So I usually take one of these filled with almonds, which really it fits like seven, and then this for my salad dressing at night with dinner. So that's what I'm eating right now. That may not sound like a whole lot of food, but I feel good. I feel hungry, um, but I'm starting to get to the point where my stomach is shrinking. I've also come off a, a kind of a few weeks of not eating well, so my stomach is enlarged. But for the most part, the discipline side of it has been really easy because I'm so focused when I can see what's in front of me. So if I know I can only have this amount, I'm going to eat that. But if there's no restriction, I kind of tend to overindulge. So I really like that everybody's making fun of me. And maybe some people are like, wow, you do a lot of these stuff. Listen, I don't diet. I eat healthy. This is just me eating healthy <laughs> with smaller amounts because... There's a wedding. If I, if my sister didn't have her wedding, I probably wouldn't be doing this, and I would just try and you know tr trek on on my own. But I need a little extra push. So, anyways, if you enjoy this video, uh, give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you're doing. If you have crunch time, I know it's wedding season, and hopefully I'll be working out again, and I will be feeling you know back to normal. Um, but anyways. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you like it and hit the subscribe button down below and I will see you soon for another video. Bye. So I realized after filming about the containers that I didn't actually tell you what I wanted to tell you. Um, so I've been eating out of the containers for a week and I have currently lost five pounds in one week. That is amazing now i don't feel like i look like i've lost five pounds sorry walter is like i don't feel like i look like i've lost five pounds probably because a lot of it is water but the scale says i have so if i continue hopefully i'll have lost 10 pounds by the wedding that's crazy but yeah anyways i just wanted to add that in bye